Another week, another asinine video project. Sorry, Professor. This week's topic is talking about a class that has impacted us in some way. Last semester, I took a modern dance class. I was taking a full load of politics classes, and my parents allow me one elective per semester to take other classes that I find interesting, but that don't necessarily contribute to my major. Uh, last semester, I chose modern dance. I actually had to talk them into that one. My father thinks that modern dance is basically a step away from stripping, or being one of those pop stars that Sirius is so obsessed with. But I managed to talk them into it, eventually. I've taken ballet for most of my life. It was one of those frivolous activities that my parents encouraged when I was younger, because unlike a certain good-for-nothing thing sibling of mine would have you believe, our house was not, in fact, some gloomy, silent castle. At least, not all the time. Ask them to play Moonlight Sonata for you sometime. And then run. Anyway, back on topic. Most of my classes at Hogwarts University thus far have been fulfilling and interesting. Some of them have even challenged me. Modern dance was a different experience from anything that I had previously known. It felt like less of a class and more of an escape as the semester wore on. It's shown me ways to express myself that I didn't even know were possible. There's something freeing and empowering about physically expressing your emotions in such a raw form, and unlike with ballet, I got to break out of traditional movements and create new movements based on ideas or emotions. Ballet is incredibly precise and demanding. Modern dance is too, but in an entirely different way. I was forced to rethink my entire conception of movement. Suddenly, even the simplest steps were difficult, because I had to do them in ways that I'd never even considered before. I still have to fight myself over the smallest things, like doing pirouettes in parallel rather than turned out. I still go by the studio from time to time, and sometimes instead of doing ballet, I'll work through what I've learned in modern dance and play around with different music. Um, I've actually been working on choreographing a routine for the dance show at the end of the semester. My parents don't exactly know about that. I think Sirius assumed that I dropped dance once I started college. Uh, the way they see it, they chose their passion, and I chose to do what my parents wanted. But it's really not that simple. I can do both. I can at least try to do both. If you're, if you're watching this video, which I doubt, but if you're watching this video serious, I wish you'd tried to do both, instead of just putting yourself first like you always do. <sighs> Never mind. Note to self, edit that last bit out of the final product. Dancing has become something that I genuinely look forward to, which is why it's doubly obnoxious that my pea-brained sibling and their band of imbeciles decided to ice over the hallways in the student center this morning. Really, who takes that much time out of their life just to make the halls of one of the most commonly used buildings on campus into sheets of ice? First of all, it's idiotic, but more importantly, it's dangerous. I would know, considering that I slipped and ended up spraining my wrist. Once I have regained a full range of motion, I am going to strangle the aforementioned sibling and bury them in a shallow grave. As if they haven't caused me enough suffering, it seems that they have now decided that it's their life mission to annoy and inconvenience me at the worst times. I have to present the first minute of my choreography on Wednesday, and I can't move my wrist. Of course, I don't want to give the impression that I'm clumsy. The fact that I'm a trained ballet dancer should be enough to tell you otherwise. But if for some reason you're still in doubt, the only reason I fell was 
that I was running late and I wasn't exactly expecting the halls indoors to be covered in ice. The most annoying part of all this is that some of the fools on this campus actually thought that this was funny. Some of my alleged friends even went ice skating. I'm gonna blame it on hormone imbalances. But back to the topic at hand, I love taking modern dance, and if I could fit it into my schedule again, I would love to continue taking more diverse dance classes. Maybe tap, or uh, there's an African dance class that looks really interesting. Um, I've never really had an emotional outlet quite like this, and modern dance is not only a good workout, but a beautiful art form that I'm proud to say that I'm quite good at. I highly recommend it for anyone looking for a challenge, although some people may want to stay away if they expect me not to throttle them. I hope that everyone on this campus finds a class that they love as much as I love modern dance, and I hope that those people also now know not to sabotage the student population with treacherous conditions inside of main buildings. Someone really needs to just put a leash on Sirius. And Jamie.